Environmentalists are worried litter washed around by the flooding could end up in the Tennessee River. But litter, microplastics, and petrochemicals, which run off from roads after flooding and pollute the river, are only part of this problem. Tennessee Riverkeeper reports there have been more than 200 sanitary sewer overflows in North Alabama in just the last week. They say this creates unsafe conditions for fishermen. Anyone who's ever fished knows it's very common to get cuts on your hand. And if there's sewage in the water, which is very common after big rain events, then the, the fishermen can get infected, uh, their hands can get infected, their cuts can get infected, and we see that all the time on the river. They are advocating for a better notification system about sewer overflows. He also says with Mardi Gras coming up, it's important to make sure your Mardi Gras beads don't end up as litter, which happened a lot last year.